I had some difficulty in communicating um, in the English language while growing up. I was in form two. And I decided, I said, wait a minute. Whether you are in science or in arts and liberal arts and uh, social science, you will still need to communicate your findings in case you're a researcher. You still need to communicate if you are providing services anywhere. So, boy, you better wake up and deal with this issue. So, I gathered a host of African Writers series. And I tell you, I got so motivated because uh, a lot of those writers were people from sciences. I mean, so I said to myself, you don't have to be in the arts to communicate effectively. I saw there that Cypran Nequency was a pharmacist, a literature moderate mathematics. And these are all great writers that produce literature for people in core English to study. So I got motivated. One man, one match, I've forgotten his name, and all of those stuff. He was in mechanical engineering. What do you call him? T.M. Maluko or something. I got all of them, man. After reading them through, man, I, I became a wordsmith. I could put words together at any instance by bailing myself out of that predicament. No one has ever written any speech for me in my life or any keynote address. No. I write, I edit, and it's out. I brought myself out of that situation at a tender age. It's all up to you. Every quality investment today yields dividends for you tomorrow. So, get into it.